The School of Music at Northern Illinois University continues to be at the forefront of using technology to break down the barriers created by distance. Whether performing at conferences in Philadelphia, receiving instruction from legendary jazz trumpeter Cecil Bridgewater in New York, or giving harp lessons to kids in Costa Rica, NIU students and faculty are able to share the gift of music through the use of internet technologies. It's an interesting uh, experience for sure. It's, it's very different from um, having a uh, live person to play with, you know, right in front of you. But, um, it, but it, it's just amazing uh, technology that you, you get to play with a person that you've never met and, you know, over the internet. It's very helpful. Um, and the sound that comes through across the, the internet, you know, it's, it's as close to, to you know, a live performance as you can get. It seems that even even some of my colleagues and friends in the in the, uh, the music industry are giving and receiving you know lessons like over Skype and, and those kinds of things and connecting with people that way. And I think this this enables us to to break through a lot of boundaries. Um, and and I think putting NIU on a on a larger stage, uh, I think is is a great thing, uh, which is obviously one of the the reasons to do this, but also. Uh, the fact that uh, it gives students access to a lot more. There are, really are no boundaries. So they get a little bit of a taste of what, what it might be like to uh, study with someone in a different culture. That, that is important as we um, blend our, our ideas together. I was very excited and appreciative for the opportunity to meet meet these students and to hear what what music they were preparing uh, which is different from my own some of the music is different um, to be able to see them know that this is live that it's almost the same thing as sitting in the studio with them so now I have another network that's that's really exciting to me it, it sort of drops the boundaries and uh, I, I see it as the wave of the future. Mm -hmm.